What's up guys? This is Coach Donnie with ElevateYourself.org. I am especially excited today. I know I always say that for my vlogs, but I am using the brand new DJI Pocket 2, which is a super small handheld gimbal. And a special thanks to all the Patreon members who've been supporting me and Elevate Yourself. I've been able to purchase new gadgets to make better quality videos for you guys. So thanks again. This camera is so sick and I cannot wait to test it out today. So please forgive me if some of the video is kind of funky. Maybe I'm not zooming in and out correctly or not balancing the camera. This is my first time using it, but I'm sure I'll get better at it with practice. And already it's way easier than just holding my iPhone right in front of me or using the traditional gimbal. The second reason why I'm excited is we got these brand new volleyball shoes in today that I'll be trying out for my volleyball training session. See, I'm still learning how to manipulate this camera movement here. But these are the Nike Hyper Sets. You guys are get to see the original unboxing. I'm not sure what's up with the names. These names are kind of funky from Nike. I would definitely come with some better, cooler names like some Volley Shoe series or something like that. But the last two Nike shoes I've tried, you'll see here, is the Hyper Ace and of course, my favorite Nike Hyper Zoom attacks. And my experience with Nike volleyball shoes has been great so far. So, can't wait to test these out on the court. I'm really looking forward to this traction. The last couple of Adidas shoes I've tried had not had great traction. Now the third reason why I'm excited is we got two special guests today that will be practicing with us for our volleyball training. Usually I just do practices with Kai just because we've both been very safe and very conservative with our coronavirus exposure because we don't want to get sick and we don't want to get our friends and family sick. And we thought maybe it'd be fun if we can do some doubles with two other volleyball players that we trust that have been pretty disciplined during the quarantine and not doing too many risky things to infect themselves. So we reached out to Brant and Chris and after talking to them for a little bit, They've also been very disciplined during the quarantine, barely leaving the house only for essential activity. So we're happy to have them as part of our practice. I think we can have a pretty safe volleyball practice in terms of the coronavirus exposure. So it's gonna feel really great again to maybe play some doubles and definitely do some reps with them. We got an hour left before we start our practice. So before I play, I like to make myself a protein shake and add a little bit of creatine from my favorite supplement company, which is Upper Echelon Nutrition. So I prepared the shake within a minute. It tastes great and it's gonna allow me to recover it as I'm playing. If you wanna try your own Upper Echelon Nutrition supplements, use my discount code in the description box to get 10% off your supplements. And of course, we cannot forget my favorite pre-workout. We got this beautiful cup of milk tea with grass jelly and I actually bought three of them instead of going back every single day and buying one individually I just bought a whole batch so I don't have to keep going back to it so I'm definitely not going to drink all three of these that's going to be way too much sugar and caffeine for one day but one per day every other day would be good Ooh, and I forgot about this my mom made us some tong yun um, that in Cantonese that's just a special soup with dough balls and some minced pork and some melon Use a reserve for holidays, but my mom made it for my grandma's birthday and she has a leftover and she sent it to me. So I can't wait to snack on this after the training session. So I'm gonna simp on my protein shake and work on some more videos. So I give myself an hour to digest this protein shake. I'm not playing with a full stomach. And then I'm gonna get ready to go play and train for some volleyball. You guys better watch out. Now that I got this DJ pocket camera, I might be vlogging all the time. So we just got here at UC Elite. I'm here rocking the Elevate face mask. If you want your own Elevate face mask, make sure you check the Elevate Apparel store and get it while supplies last. Working our way to the front door here with my volleyball cart. So here's the check-in temperature. Once you check in, then you gotta fill out this questionnaire. So let's see what my temperature is.
97.7 I'm good to go finding our way to the volleyball court I think they're cleaning it right now we got our beautiful court just freshly cleaned it's gonna be super sticky and I love being the first one here I just did some b-roll footage for my review video for the Nike Hyperset volleyball shoes and now it's time to get my own warm-up in I'm just so excited to play with Brant and Chris again. It's going to be a good volleyball day, even if we suck. So, I'm just waiting for the first volleyball friend to walk through that hallway. And I think I heard someone check in. So let's see who the first person is. Brant! So Brant, what have you been up to? Uh, not too much. Living uh, quarantine lifestyle. Getting right. some weight. There you go. But it's good to see Donnie again. Yeah. It's good to play some volleyball. In over a year. And uh, those special knee pads that for, are special from the last EVL tournament haven't been washed yet, so can't wait to see how they. First time opening up the bag in over a year. So it'll be fun. <laughs> the return of Aquaman. <laughs> a little extra aqua. Soon to be Thor. <laughs> Ooh, that, that braid is sick. Oh Does it come with a hammer? I wish. Let me, let me look at my. Uh, Oh man, so Chris just had a, a baby boy. Yeah, I've pretty much been taking up most of my time. Yeah, so congratulations to him. Yeah. Trying to train him to be left-handed. It's hard though. He's <laughs> using that right hand. Those devils? Ah, what the? Heck? They don't know any better. What's Kai been up to? Uh, been lucky enough to be training for a little bit, just like once a week, but living the. The quarantine lifestyle as well. Not hair, not as long as Chris's, but get in there. Yeah, try it for the first time. All right, we're gonna get warmed up, loosen up, get some reps in, and man, I can't wait to to train with these guys. We're gonna take more breaks because I think they have trouble breathing. We're used to training with masks, but they haven't done this in a while, so more breaks. We got an hour left and we gave them the option to do reps because kind of I've been doing reps every week so we're used to it. We're going to give them an option since they don't get to do this very often. So instead of doing reps, we're going to go into doubles while we still got energy. So we'll see how good this looks. Chris might have to bring out the hammer. Oh, man. All right, I'll take Chris first.
All right, now we're gonna try to figure out where to eat. Ooh, I could do some Olive Garden. All right, unfortunately, Chris can't join us because he's got a baby to go home to, little Wolfgang. All right, Chris, how do you pronounce it? David Wolfgang. Wolfgang, that's, his, that's a badass middle name, man. Wolfgang. Wolfgang. All right, we changed our mind because I forgot I have to be home at 7.30 for an interview with a super special guest on the next episode of The Dig. And I can't be late for that because this is a once in a lifetime opportunity. And you guys will meet who he is later. So luckily for us, Jollibee's is in the same complex. This is Filipino fast food. So this will be a little faster for us so we can spend more time hanging out and not have to wait for too long for the food. What? You know what you're gonna get? I'm gonna get the spicy chicken sandwich. Oh. I think I'm gonna get the two-piece chicken with spaghetti and probably a little little sandwich along with that. I'm pretty hungry. All right, the food took forever. We got the spaghetti finally. Two pieces of chicken, crispy chicken sandwich. Mm. My first time eating their spicy chicken sandwich is really good. Now it's time to try the spaghetti. I just got home from dinner and I'm pretty full. That was a pretty heavy meal, but I ate super light for the first half of the day so I could enjoy this heavy meal. And now I'm about to interview the legendary John Dunning from Stanford Women's Volleyball. He's won five national championships, which is insane, and he's won at two different universities. I don't know if it's ever been done before to win at two different universities. So here we got the questions that I'll be asking him in the script. Got my webcam and then over here he's waiting in the room for me to add him so I'm not gonna make him wait any longer. Let's get this interview going. Wow, that was an awesome interview. We went from 7.30 to 9.10 so almost two hours just talking volleyball and I can't wait for you guys to watch the episode. Coach John Dunning is such an awesome guy and I'm just so grateful for him to take the time out of his day to talk to just an average volleyball guy like me. When you get two volleyball junkies together in a room, you're just going to pepper the ball somehow. Or you're just going to find a random object to set or pepper and you're going to talk volleyball. That's just how it goes. If you're a volleyball junkie too, let me know in the comments. So it's 9.15 p.m. on Friday night and I'm starting to get pretty tired. My eyes are dry been running around all day and we did two hours of volleyball with the crew and I taught all morning so my voice is tired from teaching all week I'm really tempted to go get some Baskin Robbins ice cream because I'm just craving it and I know I'm trying to lean down from Thanksgiving but sometimes the cravings just come calling I was craving some Baskin Robbins ice cream but they're closed right now and you see I have to wear my glasses because my eyes were just getting so dry from being so intently focused on the interview and it's late at night so I had to take my contacts off. We're gonna scour the counters of Safeway for a dessert that catches my eye. Do I want ice cream? Ooh, they got some Baskin Robbins right there. Or do I want one of these yummy cakes? I love Safeway Bakery. They do such a good job. You know what? I love cinnamon rolls. I was actually gonna get one from McDonald's, but theirs is not very good. And I've been walking through the bakery, and this is only five bucks, and Safeway's bakery is pretty good. I might give them a shot. I think I'm gonna sell on this. Originally, I wanted ice cream, just cause I love mint chocolate chip, but it's really cold outside, so I think I might eat a hot cinnamon roll with some milk to end my meal for the day. You can see how the breathing is like fogging up my glasses. So I feel bad for the people that have to wear glasses during the pandemic and a mask. So I microwave the cinnamon rolls, nice and soft and oozy. I really hope it tastes good because there's a lot of them in there. And I probably could have eaten two or three of these, but I'm trying not to go too crazy today. Just a little bit crazy. And of course, while enjoying a game of volleyball. I hope you guys enjoyed this volleyball vlog. I'm really loving this DJI Pocket 2 gimbal. It's my first time using it, but it's been really easy to use and it makes vlogging so much easier 
versus having to do this with a giant phone and, and to put it, hold it far away. And it has the stabilization technology. So this is definitely a keeper. I hope you guys enjoyed this volleyball vlog and are staying safe out there. We'll see you guys in the next video.